And let's quickly go to Jaws uh, in Plateau State, where we have Major General Nicholas Ibe. He's the commander of the Special Tax Force Operation Safe Haven. Let's talk about security issues, uh, uh, General uh, Ibe. Many things are happening in the country, specifically around the border there, uh, looking at Plateau State, looking at Jaws, and looking at the Herdsmen Farmers Clash. What can you tell us about your operation there, Safe Haven? Yes, thank you, Suleiman. Uh, currently, we are building, making, and consolidating peace on the plateau. Uh, and also, uh, discussing, dialoguing with headsmen and cattle uh, uh, through town hall meetings, through uh, village hall meetings, also with them. We are also spreading our tentacles across the southern Cardinal bordering plateau states in support of our colleagues that are operating in southern Cardinal. Uh, this is what we are doing for now. Although we also have challenges with some of the illegal miners are operating with, uh, within plateau state. But uh, we are managing that through the effort of the state government because mining, as you know, is an exclusive use of the federal government. And uh, we are working with the civil defense the Nigerian police and other security agencies to also ensure that there's the peace in the plateau is sustained for now. Any meeting between the farmers and headsmen and your uh, command? Yes, several. We've had several meetings with the headsmen, the Nieti Anla, the Cattle Breeders Association, and the traditional rulers, the youths of the various communities, and also having a meeting with Khan the traditional rulers and, and members of the state government officials to ensure that um, we sustain the peace that we're building on the plateau for now. Uh, I'll leave, uh, you know, with this. Uh, tell us what the relationship uh, has been like between the civil population and the Nigerian military around that uh, area. Uh, Keeping keep in, keep in mind that you were once the head of the Nigeria military and civil relations uh, in the country. What's been like uh, at the moment? Yes, we also have strategy of building a, a gap and closing the gap between the military and the civil companies. We've established some uh, programs from winning the hearts and minds of the people through providing some facilities such as boreholes where there are no water to the community. We also provide um, writing materials for the primary schools. We also provide teachers. Soldiers teaching in primary schools where there are no teachers or where the community have been sacked, like we have in Southern Kaduna. We are also providing medical outreach to support the various civil communities. And uh, with that, we've been actually uh, been able to establish very good rapport with the civil community. And they're also able to pass information to us as regards I think that's, that's fantastic. A good a place for us to wrap up the show this evening. We'd like to thank you uh, very much, uh, Major General Nicholas Rogers eBay, Commander Operation Safe Haven, speaking with us all the way from Jaws. It's been a moment, a fantastic one here on State of the Nation. And uh, we'll join you again next week, Friday.